Hey everybody, Johnny5 Alive here and welcome back to another video. Today we're going to be doing something a little bit different. I want to introduce you to a guy named Chris Dark Art. I met him a long, long time ago when I first started my channel and I needed some art done. I'll bring up the very original character sketch that he did for me way back when. And then not too long ago, I want to say like six months ago or something, maybe a little bit longer, I reached out to him again and uh, asked for some updated characters. Uh, well, actually, I asked for characters for Chant Wix, Web Searcher, and Floss for the Hot Dog and Missy Good Squad for my channel as they were hosted and featured in, in a lot of my videos. They were co-hosting a lot of the stuff. So he had made vast improvements on his art since the last time I had talked to him. So he, he was showing me the differences and they're so much better. And so I also got him to update my character as well. So the reason I want to show you guys all this stuff is to basically get him some more exposure. He is a struggling artist after all. I did find him on a site called Fiverr. It's it's kind of like a third party site for, I guess like they get, I don't know how to explain it, but essentially you can get like really cheap art for like five bucks. It's called Fiverr for a reason, but it kind of scales up. It's not just, you can get quick art for five bucks. And in my opinion, it's a little bit unfair how easily you can get this art considering in Canada and the United States, it's about $40, $45 to hire a concept artist and you're getting a full piece of concept art for anywhere between five and $40 on this site. It's quite crazy to me. And uh, you know, it must, it must be hard for people in this position. So definitely I, I've always been trying to throw some work Chris's way by, you know, getting as many characters as done as possible. So I wanted to show you guys some of this stuff. If you're interested in just getting your own character for your own reasons or your own videos, if you're a YouTube channel and you need a character for your banner or your videos or what have you, he's a really great option and I really, really love his style. So I'm gonna bring up some characters like my, my original character I just showed off. I'm going to show you guys the updated version of my character. And then we have Wix, Web Searcher, Chant, and Floss. This is our Missy Goods and Hot Dog Squad. So he, we had a couple ideas. Like he, I showed them picture, I showed him pictures of them and he did a really good job of capturing how they looked, but then put a style on them. With the Missy Goods, I wanted them to have like pink jackets, like they were from like the Grease Lightning kind of uh, show. And then the guys, I wanted them to have like brown jackets and red shirts for the Hot Dog Squad, for the Planet Coaster and, and Theme Park community. And then my character, obviously I want to wear blue. So we had this like pink, red, and then me as the chief beef, I had the hamburger pajamas, which I do own in real life, by the way. <laughs> and he put a little bit of flair on all these characters. Um, so what you're seeing in the background here is him drawing my other buddies, uh, Zelixor, Thunderbud, and Synchros. I mainly needed Synchros a character because he's the newest member of the hot dog squad for Planet Coaster, and he's actually doing his own independent videos for my channel. And he's uh, basically he records them and he edits them and he's he bought and he's paying monthly for premiere just like me so i was able to give him my premiere files and basically teach him and apprentice him on how to make uh planet coaster videos the exact same way i do so he's actually recording them by himself he's editing them by himself but he's using my methodologies and templates to do so and they come out very similar to my videos and so far you know he we threw him right in the deep end and his first video i think got five or eight thousand views he's gone on to do three or four of these and they each continue to get about eight thousand views now for someone that's never ever ever put their voice out there or their personality in front of an audience to just be thrown into it and get eight thousand views is quite nerve-wracking and synchros has done a very good job so far i'd have to say in holding his own when you start a new channel you have the time to develop yourself you do video after video and you slowly develop you know what you are like and what you don't like and all these different things and then you see the comments and the critiques and you slowly adjust but when you're just thrown in told to do it the way i do it it's a very hard thing to do and 
and he's done a very good job of upholding that. So I thought he needs to have his own character, his own character intro. So when you watch it, you know, hey, this is a Synchros video uh, right out of the gate. So he can introduce himself with a hey yo character of himself. The intro flips to him instead of me, and then it goes on to Park Spotlights. Now, of course, I've been playing a lot of games, as you guys may have seen from Fallout 76 with the Diggler's Inn. We did some skits where Zelixor was the vault tech employee and uh, Thunderbud was the, uh, the, the crazy... I don't even know what you want to call him, the crazy man that runs the inn, uh, kind of a freak show. We did some pretty funny skits with that. So I figured I would just go ahead and, and get them some characters too, because hey, they're my buddies. And at the end of the day, I don't even know if I'm going to use these characters. I know it's going to use synchroses, but if we do host a video together where all three of us are together, I can introduce them, bring some characters on screen and that sort of thing. But j right now they're just, essentially we're just using the faces of the characters in Discord. Discord. So if you are on our discords, uh, any of them, Fallout 76, Planet Coaster, or Channel 5 Gaming, which is all things variety gaming. And right now it's pretty bumping in here for Anthem. So the Anthem fans know what it's about. And, you know, we're going to do new games going forward, like The Division. Anyways, they have their own icons that, you know, make them stand out and somewhat match with me cohesively. So they're basically, I paid for some glorified uh, face icons for them for now, but I do hopefully plan to use them in the future so that's what you're seeing in the background here um some some sped up footage of chris dark art doing his thing rocking it up and this is at 20 times speed so you can imagine you know this 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 would have taken 20 times longer to draw and these aren't even the original sketches so the way chris does things is he will draw a sketch of your character if you like it you you know you just say continue on or you can say no i want you to add you know with thunderbuds we're like I want you to add a gun. I want you to add this like emblem because Thunder was in the army. So we got the emblem on the shirt. We have a gun. We got a cigar. I gave him a bunch of pointers. I actually originally asked for that and he did it in the sketch, but then Thunder added a few things in to make it that much better, like the grenade and the thing on the shirt and the dog tags. So he went ahead and added all that in. Everybody was happy with it. You just make subtle adjustments and he listens to it. So I think at the end of the day, he charges his regular charge fee for these characters is about $45, which is actually a phenomenal price overall and then he could do other things like he does emojis i think it's like five five bucks an emoji or something he has a whole youtube package where he'll design your banner he'll decide design your twitch buttons um all sorts of stuff you get this entire package done and i think that's like 60 or 80 bucks but anyways i'll have a link down to chris dark arts uh fiverr profile and you could use that and you know do it through that system although they do take a cut and uh they also kind of undercharge the artist which i think is a little bit unfair so what i'll also do is give uh give out his discord information which i helped him put together and you can click on the discord and join there and personally contact him as well as his facebook page now i highly recommend you go to either his discord or facebook page contact him there and then just paypal him the money i think that's the most generous way you can reward an artist for their hard work with no middleman in between and uh you know and and help him make his way through and, and you know give him some work and i'm sure he would appreciate it and he he definitely deserves it he definitely does some amazing stuff as you guys have seen from this video here as well as uh you know all the different characters i've shown off that i'm happy with and i'm a very happy customer for, and i always go back to him and i will continue to go back to him in the future and uh you know you basically contact him he shows you the sketch and once the drawing is done he'll basically show it to you but he won't give you the psd um, the final full-sized images and all the little details he'll send you that entire package in a, in a Google Drive zip folder um, once you've basically sent him the payment so it's very legitimate he's very kind he's also very fast the whole process of me getting these characters done for him was just a matter of a couple days I shot him the idea he cr created them I said great and then I shot him the money and we're good to go so very legitimate guy and I definitely give my recommendation with him um so i just really wanted to make this video to help him out because uh you know <laughs> 
I, I know what it is like to be like an artist and uh, it can be it can be a struggle at times and I think he's he needs a little bit more exposure and recognition so if you feel like just getting a character drawn for your boyfriend or your girlfriend or your YouTube channel or whatever you're doing I think it's a lot of fun and very affordable and you can get something cool and make a gift card out of it or print it out on a shirt or do whatever you want with it and it's always cool to have an avatar slash character of your own and I'm also you know he'll also do different things like maybe you just want the head for your own discord icon pretty sure he'll draw your face or your head for a very discounted cheap price of like 20 bucks or something not exactly sure the prices but you can talk to him yourself but let's uh let's do the guy let's do a guy a favor and uh, try to get him some more work so if you uh, know anyone that's in need of some character art some YouTube art or anything like that send them this video send them this link and send them to Chris Darkheart he's definitely an amazing guy and uh yeah so I'll end off the video showing you all the characters that he's ever drawn for me here quite amazing everybody that's pretty much going to do it for this video here today just wanted to showcase how amazing this guy is boom so there you guys have it something different here today hope you enjoyed it and thank you so much for watching as always and I will see you in the next video bye now